And it's JJ Lalbeck, Lua! And they are leading by two goals to one on aggregate. As cool as it is. The attack! What a goal! What a brilliant goal that is! And it's JJ Lalbeck Lua. That has been a top finish from the Mizzle forward. One of the best goals of this competition without a doubt. Look at that of a finish. Again, it's a lovely ball forward. Is now the chance. Probably does him. And JJ Lalbeck Lua makes it 2-1. He's onside. He's checked with the assistant referee. Here from this straight ball opportunity or not. In swing floater, it's another opportunity. Oh, that's the third goal. What a resounding comeback into this game. He scored a stupendous goal against Turkmenistan in the World Cup qualifying game as well. And this is another one. Into the box. He's waiting for the ball. No one on him at all. JJ there! Oh, he's got the goal! Into the far corner. And clawed back an equaliser. Well, that's football. Unbelievable period, that, isn't it? We're into the fourth minute of stoppage time. Into the box. He's waiting for the ball. No one on him at all. JJ there! Oh, he's got the goal! Into the far corner. And clawed back an equaliser. Well, that's football. Unbelievable period, that, isn't it? We're into the fourth minute of stoppage time. And a player whose name you barely mention in this second the goal so that is on to the first minute very first minute of the second half India has taken the lead again so look at that Baldi releases the ball and this gets it JJ acute angle and that was this is the final touch so Baldi Sunil Chet all about finishing on top of their group where Hong Kong currently sit on the back of their superior goal difference Cross comes in, Ashik Karunian is there, and there it is, there it is! Who is having the season of his life. Stupendous football. This is individual stuff at its very best. Look at that finish. It's class written all over it. Another beautiful. In this angle, chip up. Pilkington plays it oh, back, of course. And it's headed in from close range by JJ, who finally gets a goal. Well, he's been waiting a long, long time. Only three shots in six matches this season for JJ, but I think that's his first touch since coming on. And we do have double figures. Great end of the car, he plays it to the back post to Pilkington and he absolutely puts it on a plate for JJ. And this is 10 goals, this makes a record yet again and it's an Indian player that makes the record. It's a wonderful ball by Pilkington and he puts it on a six-month. But JJ had a little bit to do, he had a step. Okay. 
ډیری مسلمانان لوبه غړي دي چې لوبېږي په دغې لوبډله کې اوس نو یو ځل بیا د هندوستان لوبغاړي او موقعیت د هندوستان لوبغاړي لپاره دوه همه ګول وهل په دغې سیالۍ کې د دغه لوبغاړي دا ځل لال پیکوال اوس وایي چې ګول وهنه وکړي دوه همه ګول وهنه تر دې ځایه د هندوستان لپاره دوه ده سفر په پایلې سره هندوستان تر مالدیف مخکې لوبډله ده او تر ډېره بریده اوس نو کار د ښاغلي هربرټ ریکي د شاګردانو لپاره لږ څه نور هم سخت شو یعنې د مالدیف د لوبډلې لپاره کار تر دې ځایه د هندوستان په نه په روان دی څومره پرله پورې پاس ورکونه او کره کره چې په دې شان باندې په خپله لال پیکوال وتوانې د دغه شیبه په ګول باندې تبدیله کړي او د تماس مرة أخرى مباشرة كأنها ركنية شوف الأمام الكرة خطيرة خطيرة جدا لا زالت الخطيرة أول وهذا هو الحديث اللي قبل البداية هذا هو الحديث الذي كنا نتحدث مع الدقائق الأولى عن أن المنتخب الهندي ربما يستغل هجمة مرتدة حتى حتى الرجل الرجل ديز ديزموند بولبن الرجل الانجليزي الذي قال باننا جئنا لحصد النقاط الثلاثه شوف معي رميه التماس مباشره ستة يارد دوران وبعد ذلك ايضا جيجي جي المهاجم مهاجم المنتخب الهندي هذا الرجل الذي يلعب في انديان اروز سجل الهدف الاول Pereira. Good ball to Sunil Chetri. Good end to end action now. Sunil lets fly. Goalkeeper stops and that's the first goal. And at last India has scored. At last India have their supporters, give their supporters something to cheer about. Nice goal, JJ Lal Peklua, the Mizoram boy. And the sheer happiness, Marcus Pacheco and all the other officials hugging the... the
Well, Miss uh, Cross from the right flank made the problem. What a cross from Jackie Chan. And it's a cool, calm, composed finish from the Mohan Bagan forward. Here they come again. Suddenly the Afghanistan defense is at sixes and sevens. JJ Lalpek Lua can wrap it up. And he does. It's 3 0. And this youngster has scored in the final. Here is a man who is going to serve Indian football for many years. So JJ Lalpeklua has made it 3-0 and it's becoming a rout. But the scoreline doesn't really reflect the match. It is much closer than what the scoreline is. He's taken too long, has he? Oh, the chance is here. And the chance is taken. And JJ stretches the arms out wide because... And guess who's got the goal for them? <laughs> well, there you go. Jerry. Trying to split the central defenders. JJ tussling away with Eduardo. And gets the better on him. And down's off his line! What a goal! We said we were waiting for JJ to prove what he can do. And he's done it here in the 28th minute. He tries an adventurous flick on towards Sunil Chetri. Sunil. Polichara Nazi will have to do a lot of hard work to chase that down. He does. Eugene Sindlingo behind him. Nazri crosses it in. Sunil Chetri is there with the header. JJ Lalpik. India have an equalizer. India have an equalizer to JJ Lalpik. His third goal of the South Suzuki Cup. It's 1 1 on the night. India 1, Afghanistan 1. JJ's goal. Yes, sir. I remember every time that we thought that JJ and Chetri had the ball. This lethal combination has worked once again for India. Both the players, look at the calm composure of this player, Sunil Chetri getting that deflection, he comes in and good work from Holy Charan, Sunil Chetri coming under the ball, giving it up, the defender just leaving that ball for the goalkeeper, but look at JJ, the way he comes from behind and just stretches his leg, goalkeeper has got no chance whatsoever, this is a sneaky goal I would say. India have forever craved that poacher's instinct in the 18-yard box. It comes from the likes of JJ Lal Peklua on this occasion. His third goal of this edition of the South Suzuki Cup scored two in the previous game. Could this be? Wouldn't be happy with that. Rafi is interested. Daniel with a beautiful finish. JJ, in fact, with a beautiful finish. Just guiding the ball into the back of the net. A superb cross. And given the result, it so deserved. JJ with another goal at the Mumbai Football Arena. It's 2 0 to India versus Nepal. 
Nasri with the cross and who else but the Mizo sniper. He scores another for India and India needed it. We're looking for inspiration from Sunil and Gurpreet on the pitch. But here's one man who's been an unsung hero over the last uh, two years. Strong second half. Well, that's not his best cross. Still drops to an Indian boot. Oh, Jiran. It's JJ. It's a goal. India are going to win this one. It's JJ who's been on the pitch for two minutes. What about this first goal line? It's Thailand 1, India 4. And JJ has just scored his first goal for 10 months. Four on India. Unbelievable. Oh, look at that. What a substitution. No wonder they're high fiving down on that Indian bench. JJ takes the salute. The man from Chennai. It wasn't the best of clearing headers. And then it's uh, Hollich. Pikosh. Preetam Kotal on the overlap for India. Crosses in. Tries to find Chetri who heads the ball towards JJ. Who heads the ball into the goal. Seventh goal in the last seven games for JJ Lal Pekrua in national colours. India 3-1 up in the 33rd minute at the brand new Mumbai Football Arena. Well, he's got a chance to add to his tally and finally, and finally the Mizo sniper strikes at the Kantirva. And the man who put India ahead on the hour mark. Here's another opportunity. JJ! Oh, it's a JJ will join the party. Well up in the knock. JJ Lal Bekua, the measles sniper, finds the back of the net. In an absolutely glorious.